Welcome Virgo. This is Renee. Welcome back. Welcome to your reading Virgo. This is your next 48 hours. And if this reading resonates, please like and subscribe. If it doesn't resonate, go ahead and take a look at your other placements. Okay, let's get into it. What's going on for Virgo the next 48 hours? Give me a message for Virgo the next 48 hours, please. Message for Virgo. And by the way, this is a, a general reading. So we'll, we'll cover anything that comes through. Okay, what's going on for Virgo? What can they expect? What's coming through? Okay, we have Ace of Emotion. So the Ace of Cups. Wow. You may have love coming through, Virgo. This cherub is announcing that a wonderful new emotional experience is coming into your life. You may meet someone new who makes your heart flutter. Or your current relations will experience a reawakening. It's also possible that your intuitive abilities will be greatly increased by your open heart. Okay, so yeah, I feel like there may be someone new coming in for you. Look at this. We got the healer of emotion. So this is like the, the queen of cups as well. So this is the time to follow your heart and feel the fullness of your emotions. You may feel so compelled to nurture others that you forget to care about yourself. Flashes of intuition provide you with incredible insights. You or another person is a kind, tender-hearted, loving, and trustworthy friend. Okay? So definitely some kind of love coming through here. This is, this may be a new relationship coming through. Okay? Yeah, we have a new beginning at the bottom. So there's something new that's starting. This is the full energy. Okay? Um, so this is definitely some kind of new energy coming in for you. So I feel like in the next 48 hours, you may be meeting someone new. Someone new may kind of approach you or let you know their intentions. Okay, let's take a look at what's going on with Virgo in love. What's going on in Virgo's love life? Tell me more about this. Tell me what's going on in Virgo's love life. Your photograph. Someone's thinking about you. Someone's kind of spying on you. They, they're they very curious about what you're doing. Uh, they may be looking at your social media. Uh, maybe watching you from a distance. Watching you from afar. Maybe you work with this person. Or you're surrounded by this person in some way. But I feel like someone someone really misses you. They're really looking at you and seeing what it is that you're doing. They're very curious. Okay, and we have a soulmate connection. So definitely some kind of new energy coming in here. So definitely if you're open to love, Virgo, I feel like you are very capable of love at this moment. Okay, um, very interesting. Hmm. I'm seeing maybe someone that you work with. Someone that's surrounding you on not really a daily basis, but very frequently. I feel like this energy is really coming through as very familiar. Okay? Huh. Tell me more. What would this person have to say to Virgo if they had a chance? What, what does this person have to say? What are their intentions? What do they need to tell Virgo? I look for you everywhere. Yeah, like I said, I, I feel like this person is really keeping an eye on you. They really want to see what you're doing. They want to know what's going on. How to get close to you. You know, what are your likes or dislikes? And I knew exactly what I was doing. Hmm. I'm starting to understand our connection. They definitely feel very connected to you. I feel like this person may have tried to approach you on one level or another. 
and so so i feel like virgo you may really know who this person is right away okay this person may come to your mind right away by what these are saying because i feel like this person has tried very hard to kind of get your attention okay um and i i feel like with them saying i knew exactly what i was doing i feel like they were really trying to approach you they they did something maybe they were really flirting with you or maybe they had said something that came off as like really trying to get your attention or really flirting okay but i, I feel like they're they feel a very strong connection with you. They feel like this could be a very soulmate connection for them. They feel like you are kind of a good one. That's the words that I'm getting, Virgo. You're a good one. Okay? Hmm. And, I, you know, with this ace of emotions and this healer of emotions i really feel like you're kind of open to the situation as well okay you look at this i love you i feel like this is growing very strong in a, in a very short time we also have i will wait for a sign from you so you know i, I feel like this person may be waiting for you to kind of give them the nudge that they need to like move forward you know i feel like this person really wants you to know exactly how they feel you know exactly what's going on because look at this okay soulmate you know they're waiting for a sign from you they know exactly what they're doing you know and and I feel like I'm I'm getting this strong feeling that you know who this person is. That you can just envision this person by the things that are being said, you know? Because and I feel like this person really wants to be known. They really want to like come out in the open with how they feel. They're they're kind of tired of being stuck in the background. Okay? Let's get some tarot. Let's see what tarot has to say. Tell me more about this for Virgo. Tell me what's going to happen in the next 48 hours. What's going on? What can they expect? What's coming forward for Virgo the next 48 hours, please? Give me a message. Okay. Look at this. Choices. You're going to be making some very strong choices. The next 48 hours there's something coming through there's someone who really wants to communicate with you they want to really speak their truth that they, they want to um be known okay i feel like there's something that they need to get off of their chest and we have the four of swords there's a lot of swords here this could be an air sign coming through there's cups too but i feel like there's a lot of swords there's a lot of thoughts running through this person's mind they're kind of seeing themselves and like moving into this calmer space because they feel like you bring them this calmness you know and they're they're like waiting for this decision to be made but i, I feel like you're kind of waiting for something to happen virgo you're waiting for some I feel like you may be even waiting for them to step forward to you because you know we have the high priestess so this could be Pisces energy as well so this could definitely be a water sign as well coming through um, but I feel like this is very a strong connection that you have between this person this can be very magnetic I feel like your thoughts are almost connected so you and this person may be thinking the same thing you know you may want this person as badly as they want you but i feel like there's something holding you back there's some kind of choice that needs to be made so that you can move into this place of feeling more content so that you can move forward with this person i feel like there's something that's just not revealed yet that you're waiting for some sort of sign 
okay um but i feel like you know you just need to trust in the process you know take a leap it'll all work out in the end you know that's that's how i'm feeling about the situation it's going to all work out in the end you're going to speak your speak their uh, your truth they're going to speak their truth you know i feel like you're going to figure out situations it's going to all work out it's going to um move into something more positive you know your situation is going to improve okay so i because i feel like you're kind of treading water at the moment you know i feel like you're just kind of going through the motions for some reason okay these are handwritten cards but i'm going to get a message see what comes out for virgo Give me a message for Virgo. What does Virgo need to know, Spirit? What does Virgo need to know at this time? Okay, we have... Oh, I'm done. There's something that you're done with. You've learned your, you've learned your lesson. Someone's wearing a mask. Wow, you don't trust this person. Or there's someone from the past that you don't trust that's watching you. We have take a leap of faith. Hmm. You're very skeptical, Virgo. I feel like you're you're going through things. We also have ask and you shall receive. Oh wow. I seen you together, so I stepped back. Hmm. Interesting. This may be a situation. Look at this. I miss you and I need to see you. I feel like this person may have seen you with someone else. They may have seen you hanging out with someone else, maybe out with someone else. Um, but I feel like it kind of drew them back a little bit. That's the reason why they're kind of in, in their feelings at the moment. But they miss you. They need to see you. They need they need to speak some kind of truth to you, okay? And we have protect your energy. Wow. Hmm. See both sides of the situation. Wow. There's some kind of compromise that this person is wanting to make. Like I said, I feel I feel very strongly that this person has something on their chest that they need to say, okay? Hmm. Let's see. Let's get... Let's see more into this. Let's see, I need to see more into this. Tell me more about this situation for Virgo. Tell me more about this situation for Virgo. What else does Virgo need to know in this situation? Tell me more for Virgo. Next 48 hours, what does Virgo need to know? Give me a message, Spirit. The Hierophant. Someone's asking for advice, how to approach you. I feel like they're, they're very conflicted, they're very confused, but I feel like they're working up the nerve they're trying to figure things out because they want some kind of situation to come through. Um, I feel like this person sees you as someone who's very valuable, someone who's very capable. This may be also someone that's above you. Um, maybe if you work with this person, this may be maybe a supervisor or a boss, you know, someone that has a ranking above yours. Okay, um, but I feel like this person is is coming through as being stable and having their stuff together, you know. Um, but I feel like there's confusion when it comes to you, and I feel like they're asking for advice from someone close to them. They're they're not coming up with the answers by themselves, so they're asking about you. They're asking. You know how they should go about things where things where do they think things lie 
you know and I feel like you know they really want to communicate the situation they really want to take action okay and you know in the older tarot this is also choices okay so that there's some kind of choices that need to be made especially with the the eight of wands and the two of swords you know there's some kind of decisions some kind of action that needs to be taken but i feel like it needs to be very thought out action it can't just be spur of the moment kind of thing because i feel like you're too good for that okay virgo i i feel like you are you want somebody to come to you correct and legitimate you know what i mean so and i feel like you know they're taking advice how to come to you because they feel like you know you're a you're very capable and you're like a higher standard for them uh, maybe you're totally different than the to the the usual people that they're attracted to but i feel like you've got it together virgo okay so let's get some angel cards what do the angels want to say to virgo <clears throat> Give me a message. Let's see. See, we have compromise. See both sides of the situation. Someone wants you to compromise about a certain situation, okay? And we have ask your angels. So you may want to ask your angels, ask your higher power for guidance, you know, meditate on the situation. Um, really go within. Okay, improving health. Maybe that you're working on some kind of health issue at the moment as well. Okay, you may be working on exercising more or it, it may be like in a park setting that you meet this person, you know, and we have success. I feel like that's what someone is hoping for. They're hoping for success in the situation. We also have look for a sign. Okay. So, I mean. Wow. Virgo. That's what I have to say. Wow. Because the energy of this person is very strong. I really feel like. They're really wanting you really bad, you know? What angel number do we have for Virgo? Okay, now see, we have two. I'm going to read you both of them since both of them came out. Okay, we have protection. 444. Four, four. This is your time to take confidence in all that you pursue. The divine universe is working through you and protecting you. Time has come to allow all the doors of opportunity to welcome you with open arms. Okay? And your affirmation, I feel a loving care of divine protecting me. I allow myself to pursue growth and opportunity. Okay? And you also have abundance. So I feel like this is coming in with this ask and you shall receive. Okay? Because I feel like you are manifesting something. It could be this love that you're manifesting, Virgo. Um, we have 888, abundance. Blessings are here and more are on the way. Let yourself feel the abundant flow of prosperity that is all around you. As you stand in your highest self, you attract all that you once were seeking. Giving is always the doorway to success. Okay? We have success here as well. And your affirmation. The more good I do in the world, the more abundant my life grows. I radiate an energy of loving kindness. Okay? Beautiful energy, Virgo. Okay? So I hope this helps you out. Now, if this reading resonates, please like and subscribe. Hit the bell so that you don't miss any uploads. If it doesn't resonate with you, make sure to take a look at your, at your other placements. 
um, one sign may be resonating more than um, your sun sign at the moment, okay? And until your next reading, Virgo, many blessings to you. Love and light.